that dude's dead, that dude's dead. Somebody else is going to come out and kill me, probably. Yep, there he is. Right on cue. Well, I know what I'm using for my opening five seconds of this video. Hello, everyone. This is part 10, I think, of Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Drake's looking like how I feel right now, which is not that great. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm repairing, basically. So... Part nine, the last part, I, you know, I record it and everything, and that's like usually how these things go. Left it, throat hurt a little bit, and you could realize, and that you, and you noticed in that last episode, I was like coughing. I was coughing a storm. Oh, I remember this place. Uh, I was coughing up well, one hell of a storm, and I thought, okay, maybe I just like overdid it or something. Maybe I just blew my voice out or whatnot. Woke up the next day, not feeling that great. Felt pretty bad. Uh, I got sick. Uh, and I also mentioned this in a Let's Talk PlayStation. Th this will be up weeks from now, but... I believe it was LTPS 131 where I told you guys. I was like, listen, not feeling great. This ain't gonna go down too well. Or I was like, oh, it might sound bad. Uh, and, yeah, that... It, it, it turned out to sound okay. Uh, I wasn't on my A game, really, but... You know, then the following day... Which technically is still Friday. I record Let's Talk PlayStations like Thursday night. But it's technically still Friday because it's like Friday morning. Like it's late at night when I record those things. Um, so the following Friday, like afternoon, I was feeling like even worse. <coughs> and I'm still recovering as you can see. So, um, luckily it wasn't the flu or anything. It was just like a... Like, a really bad cough, and, like, I was, like, had a shortness of breath. Um, you know, my throat would hurt. Um, then, as I was recovering, like, you know, I was getting the, the nasally stuff, the drippy, the runny nose, all that, all that jazz. It wasn't great, um, by any stretch of the imagination. But, luckily, I fell off a cliff and died. No, I, I am pulling through. I'm doing better. Also, I have no fucking clue what to do here. I know I have to, like, go up high. I, like, have to climb shit. I know that. What was that? Oh, I know what that was. Okay. I was wondering what he was looking at when I hit L2. You, pro you guys probably saw it. I didn't see it. Um, hope you've played the game by now at this point, or you'll understand what that was. But we'll, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Um, so how's everybody doing? Clearly I've just filled you in on how I was doing, which wasn't great. Like I said, good thing I'm coming back. I'm coming back to my form, that's why I'm doing a Let's Play. Recording some videos, gotta get back on that A game. It's really come down to the point where I'm like, man, I've been lacking on the YouTube videos. Like, Ryan on Gaming, like, it's like been forever since I rec recorded new ones. Like, I, and I wanted to make that a weekly series, and it was a weekly series for a while. But, man, fucking working jobs, like, it sucks. And I, I want to keep working on this YouTube channel. Man, I like it. I'm proud of it. I want to keep it going. Don't want that su success to just fall short, you know? 40,000 subscribers, awesome. I want to keep it going. So, I got to keep it going. It's one of those things where you're like you're you you're you're getting motivated now. I was unmotivated, I'm motivated. Well, it's not like I was unmotivated, but it's just it's hard to do shit when you work like so many hours a week. Uh what am I supposed to do? Oh, this just made this place a death trap. Oh, that's great. Um yeah, I gotta do that shit. Am I, is this gonna keep spinning or is this like a timer I'm on now? Oh no, that chain. I gotta climb I'm gonna climb this chain. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much that. What, what, do you, what do you guys want to talk about today on this episode of Uncharted Drake's Fortune? Um, I don't know. I got, I got a few things to say. I've come to the realization today. <clears throat> well, not today. A few... I've, I've been, like, coming to terms with this for a while now, and it's weird how I have to, I have to make it sound like this, but I am unusually obsessed with, uh, with there's dialogue. I don't know. Should I stay quiet? Maybe now you can read it. I was uh, only for cutscenes while I stay completely shutty uppy. Which way should I go? This way? That way? Uh, well, if I get up there, I'm gonna get knocked off immediately. Yep, yep. <laughs> uh, I, I, it's trial and error. It's just gonna happen. Anyway, I've become 
I've I've realized I've, I've become unusually obsessed with uh, PT. Yep, playable teaser. Uh, Silent Hills, we all know what that is. Uh, the PT trailer, that uh, playable teaser that went up on the PlayStation Store. You walk through the hallways. Uh, there's Lisa. Uh, it's you know uh, Norman Reedus. Um, all that. I become obsessed with it now. When it initially came out, and like it was revealed that it was like a really scary thing, and it was really good at what it was doing with the atmosphere and everything. I was like, cool. I'm totally into that. But I'm a huge pussy. Admittedly, huge pussy pussy with that stuff. Like, I just can't do it. Uh, so, um, when I first played it, I didn't really play it at all. My friend played it, and I my eyes were covered, and when the first jump scare came, I fucking bailed. I was done. Like, I couldn't do it. I was that, that bad. But I was so fucking intrigued with... Oh, God damn it. I was so intrigued with how well that... That, that it's not a game, but I'll I'll keep call, I'll call it a game for the sake of like calling it something. But that game was just so fucking good at what it was doing that I needed to see it. I needed to get more more of it. I needed to get past it. I needed to fight the demons. Um, so, and I think I've explained this before how I finally like got over PT, which was I just googled uh or I just, uh, son of a bitch. Wow. I well okay. I guess that works. Really? No, nah, fuck that. I'm gonna restart the checkpoint. Um, <clears throat> I just YouTubed uh, some gameplay of PT, but I just like used. Uh, I think I used the Rad Brad or well, I don't know, maybe Game Grumps or something. I just I watched a bunch of commentaries of PT of people like talking over it and being funny and laughing and stuff because that helps me get through it. If I'm just watching the straight core gameplay, even if I'm not playing it, like if I'm experiencing experiencing the thing full on, it's gonna scare me. I gotta like. <clears throat> I gotta have people be stupid and silly over it, which usually I fucking hate. Like, I don't want to watch that shit. <clears throat> like, again, no offense to those guys. Uh, they have communities, like, they have people that watch them, whatever, and maybe you watch them. That's cool. Um, and some of those videos are funny. Like, I like, uh, you know, Achievement Hunter and everything a lot. But, like, point being, I just watch something that I normally wouldn't watch to help me get through watching it. Um, so... I feel so ironic saying that because here I am recording a let's play and this is me talking about stupid shit over game gameplay. <coughs> I do watch like let's plays and shit, but just not other people. So again, no offense to their, their fan bases, but anyway, that helped me get over PT. But I've just like I've gotten to the point where I just I keep watching it over and over again. Now that I've gotten over it and I know every single fucking thing about PT, I just love I I'm in love with it. I'm in love with the idea of it. I'm in love with every sequence of that game, the audio, the like story, which you know there's not much of a story, but there is you know events basically that play out. Like everything about that game that that it just fucking hit a high note. Like. It did it so well. Like, that... Like, PT nailed everything. And I'm, like, upset that it's not... That it's... Aw, oh, God. Son of a bitch. What, what? Ten minutes of this Let's Play is just me doing the same thing over and over again? Oh, thank God you stopped me here. Or you start me here. Like, it was just so good. And I'm obsessed with it now. I'm obsessed with it. And I... You know what? I, I've been... I've been watching, um... The fine bro, oh, god damn it! The fine, the fine brothers react channel. Um, watching the, the teens react to it, I thought that because I like, I love genuine reactions to stuff that I find really awesome. <coughs> so I liked watching them react to it, and like you know, they're like, of course, getting all scared and everything. But it was just, it's just awesome, man. Oh, we got a cutscene. Well, it's not really a cutscene, but hey, I made it. Oh, Graham, get a stuffy nose. That's that's awesome. Oh, circle. Son of a bitch. Did I... Oh, okay, I made it. Th that was one of those situations where my hand was off the controller. Where do I go now? Over there? <laughs> it's gonna have to be over there, because no other, no other way to go. Uh... Yes? Alright. Boop. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, there's a chain right there. I didn't see the chain. I was gonna jump. <coughs> anyway. Yeah, dude, I just, I've just come to the, I've just come to terms with the fact that I'm obsessed with PT. God damn it, really? For real? Like, but really though? It's just so good. And now, if I, I uh, am genuinely excited for the next time I have somebody over that's never heard of it. Because I'm going to make them play it. 
And it's going to be pretty much the best thing ever. Oh, this works. Kind of. Uh, get up. Get up to... Oh, God. Dude. This sucks, man. This platforming is not that intuitive. Look at me making a complaint about Uncharted right now. Uncharted 1. These mechanics are dated all of a sudden. <coughs> I can't go down here. Okay, now I'm like dying even worse than I was before. Can I climb this chain? I cannot. Oh, Drake, please. Please don't do this. Whoa! There we go. That PT, man, I'm telling you. I just... It's like everything about that thing is so good. And that's when I started to realize like I'm too obsessed with it. Was I, I, I kept re-watching the uh, React video with, uh, to PT. Like over and over and over again. Like an unusually... Like a very unusual amount of times. Um... And it's gotten to the point where I, like, feel like that's my fucking game of the year. Which is so crazy to think, because, like, it's not even a game. But that thing that, that thing just did it, just, just just was too good at what it was doing. Like, it sucks that it's not going to be more capitalized on, because realistically Silent Hills, the actual game that it was a teaser for, is more than likely going to be nothing close to that. It's going to be something different. It's going to be It's going to be a Silent Hill game, not a first-person in a house game, you know, but I would, I would so be, I would be so down for that to be like further built upon in some way, shape or form and with the original story and idea and everything, or just the visions, the, the audio or everything. Like I just loved everything about it. It was just, it was, it was dope. It was rad. It was rad as shit. I think a cutscene is coming up soon, but I'm not sure. I would really like to breathe again. Nose. <clears throat> These things always happen when I record Let's Plays. Because I was fine before I started recording this. Oh, that's an explosion. Eddie. Eddie! With his golden gun. That thing's like a multiplayer weapon in like all the Uncharted games, I think. You have to like unlock it. You can also like unlock it through the bonus things to use it in single player. Oh, great. Yeah, that's a real perfect spot to put me at aiming them. There we go. That dude's dead. That dude's dead. Somebody else is going to come out and kill me probably. Yep, there he is. Right on cue. Well, I know what I'm using for my opening five seconds of this video because I usually do that. You know, <clears throat> the thing is I record these things and then you know, I'm not going to edit them right away because I just, I just heard myself talking everything. So, I usually like let them sit for a little bit, and then I'll edit them. And but the thing, but the always catch twenty two to that is, oh, well, I want to find a like a good spot to get the first ten seconds in, because you guys know I do that. Like I have an opening ten seconds of, I don't know, whatever part particular spot I found funny, or that I think you would find funny, just to like give you a little sneak peek of the kind of dumb shit you're in for now, and. uh but by the time I'm ready to upload these things, I have no idea what's going to happen or what's said or, or, you know, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to die. Uh, so I have to, like, rewatch the whole damn thing again. And it's like, it's, like, I just played, I lived it. Like, the, basically, the sooner I edit it, the, the better I can, like, skim through it and remember what was said. And then I can maybe go to a part that I was talking about or something. I'd be like, oh, I remember where this part happened. That'd be a good part to, to save. Maybe I should write it down. Not during recording, obviously, but maybe after recording. And then I'll do it, like, during the editing. I don't know. My, I, I would have to assume my editing is... My ability to edit videos is pretty... What's the word? Not insufficient. Maybe insufficient. But it's like... It, like, there's probably tons of ways it could be faster and better yeah it could be more like i could be more efficient at it i guess you could say jesus christ where are you buddy wow really wow and he's gone there he is oh you motherfucker you piece of shit there's probably tons of way I, tons of ways i could be better at it because like it's not like i didn't go to school for it or anything 
I do use Final Cut Pro X10. Final Cut Pro X, yeah. Final Cut Pro X. And I used to use Sony Vegas Pro. Sony Vegas Pro 8. And those are professional software editing tools. And I can, you know, I've gotten, like, for somebody that didn't, didn't go to school, I think I would say I'm good. For somebody that just, like, uses it and, you know, like, learned on his own and, like, tried to follow a few, like, tutorials online. Like, I didn't even use something like lynda.com or something. Lynda.com, like, it's like a website to, like, help you learn shit, like, on computer programs and everything. I'm plugging them and I'm not even getting paid for them, I swear to God. Because, like, they do, like, uh, advertise everywhere, so that's how I know about them. But I've never used them personally. Uh, but that's what I'm saying. I've never used anything like that, so I wouldn't know. So I would say I'm probably decent, but uh, probably not perfect. <coughs> There's still a few things. Oh my god, it never ends. I I kill one dude, and then uh, fucking another one comes out of the cut. Like seriously, Jesus fucking Christ. This is me genuinely annoyed. Like that was just fucking annoying. This did this shit ever happen to me when I played on this game like four or five years ago? Seriously. I ask myself all these questions when I'm let's playing these games that I've already platinumed. Like, when did this shit happen to me? Like, that's borderline crushing difficulty bullshit. And not like that specific event would happen on crushing difficulty, but rather it, it's the same level of, of a frustrating moment. I'm scratching my nose right now. Okay, now I'm not because I'm moving my character. Oh, my aim's just so perfect. Oh, hold on. Gotta watch out for the other rocket guy. Well, the the first one. And then number two's coming. This is like I want to be the guy. Like, it's just trial and error. Or Sonic Unfair or whatever. Yup, there's that one. Fuck. Fuck, I gotta go out in the open. Oh my god, I'm screwed. <coughs> Listen, motherfucker. Okay, that only took about 23 bullets. Swear to God, dude. Swear to God. There you go. Then give me the shotgun for those that you know, that young close quarters combat. You know I'm about it. I'm always about it. Cause you know I'm all about it. No drive all. Yeah, that's a ladder. Do I shoot it or what? Or do I just get up there? Yeah, I know it's up there. Yeah, I think I have to shoot it. I see it, dude. I don't remember how to get up there, though. Alright, well, I just wasted one shot. I, I know. I know it's up there. Well, if I jump and don't make it, I'm going to be upset. I, I, where do I, how do I get up there? These are things I don't remember. Ah, oh, fuck it. <gasps> oh, I made it. Okay, I'm supposed to go this way. Somebody make my day. Okay, that's a deep hole. Come on. Just give me one. Oh, yes. Where? No, don't die. Don't die. I can't find him. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? He's up here. Where? Where is he? I don't... Oh! Oh, you son of a bitch. Dude, these rocket guys. You're so cruel, naughty dog. There we go. Yeah. Tap that triangle. That's what I do. Come on, Elena. Get your attractive little butt up here. Yeah, I called her attractive. What of it? If she were real, I'd totally date her. Oh, j for three guys, man. Three guys. And there's a rocket dude behind me or something? Oh, Jesus Christ. Murphy Jones! Motherfucker! Look at this shit, dude! Oh, fucking three dudes! This is what you fucking get. 
fucking bro where where's another one come on please where where is that coming from well I'll find out once I die Dude, I'm, f I'm flabbergasted right now. Where is this coming from? I'm leaving. Fuck this. I'm gonna be... I'm sure you guys can point them out, but I f I'm fucking blind right now, so I'm leaving. I was about to say, if I fell through that... I would've been pissed. Oh, Jesus Christ. Just for one guy. Just for you being there. We're getting close to the end of the game, though, so... Might see some shit. I mean, we will see some shit. I just don't know how soon. Probably not in this part. Uh, I guess I'll go down here. Whew. I didn't even have to do that jump. Dude, it's ridiculous where they're putting these people. I would really like to breathe right now. This is really uh, annoying me. I'd rather be, I'd much rather be drippy than runny, because at least with runny you can breathe. And I like breathing. It's cutscene time. Oh, it's really cutscene time. <sighs> There's nothing here. This is getting so old. Nate? It's Drake. He never found it. He just died here. So much for greatness. Wasted his life for nothing. Nate. Are you ready to get moving? Yeah. More than ever. There's gotta be a way okay, maybe it's not gonna get real? <clears throat> I keep forgetting when's, when, when certain stuff's gonna happen. Oh, it's gotta happen now. Looks like there's some kind of machinery up there. Machinery? I could have sworn this is when some stuff was about to happen. It's gotta happen, because there's, like, ammo everywhere. Alright, climb on. No, oh, you're heavier than you look. Can you reach it? Mm -hmm. Looks like an old hoist or something. There's a rope. I'll try to lower it down to you. Oh, I see a tunnel. We can get out this way. Hello, boys. <laughs> easy, Eddie, easy. What the hell's going on out there? Didn't you see them? Oh, no. Oh, God, no. We're trapped. Jesus, what is that? We're dead. We're all dead. <laughs> Eddie, get back here! Oh, crap. Jake, if we don't make it out of here, I just want you to know, I hate your guts. Yeah, likewise, pal. Now let's do this. Yeah, that's right, son! Uncharted has a supernatural aspect to it. As if you didn't know, this game's how many years old now. Uh, and there's other Uncharted's. Um, and spoiler alert, they all kind of, at some point or another, have a supernatural aspect to them. Uh, <clears throat> now the thing is, when this game came out back in 2007, uh, a lot of people were like, oh, I didn't like the supernatural aspect. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about, dude? That was fucking awesome. Because now that we're here, we can talk about it. Uh, I thought it was cool. I liked it. It caught me, it caught me off guard. Uh, I was like, oh, this is cool, like, it's a, you know, it's like a real game, you know, in terms of, like, uh, not like, oh, it's a real game, but like, oh, it's, you know, there's regular people, it's a regular 
human like story like it's, there's nothing video gamey about it like it's real guns and stuff like <clears throat> you, you know what I'm saying right and then <laughs> they give you the supernatural spin to it and I'm like oh that, it still works cause like it's like full on blockbuster man it's a fucking movie it's like it's so cool um and it was just creepy like it just works you know you're in this creepy like you know if treasure place and you're looking for treasure and yeah, you got people after you because you're hunting the treasure and whatever the fuck, and, and boom, these weird things come out. Uh, and then we'll learn more about what the hell these things are in a few, like, maybe one or two more parts. Um, I thought it was cool. Jesus. What's that ammo for? Ooh, yeah. Well, it's only two ammo. You know what? I'm just gonna keep walking around. I'm gonna humor you guys. Unless the game has a kill counter to where I, I gotta kill a certain amount of them for Elena to do what she needs to do. So I'm just gonna kill them. Yeah, I like I, li I like this aspect of Uncharted. People apparently don't like it. And I'm, I don't know. I just... I, I, it's like, hey, people are entitled to their opinions, but... It, they're entitled to their opinions, but it's one of those things where it's like, quit being a, like, bitch. Like, <laughs> like, just enjoy shit. Like, this was cool, man. At least to me. I, I thought it was cool. I, I just, like, it's, that's why I always tell you guys, like, oh, you'll get, get, you, you understand my personality, and you'll understand my game taste, and you'll understand that I'm the kind of person that just enjoys most things. I, I don't play most things and go, I fucking hated that, or I don't like that, or ah, blah, 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 or I'm not happy with it. You know, I can genuinely enjoy most things unless it's comp like le legitimately awful unless it's like oh jesus like if it's bad 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 like it's one of those things where it's like on metacritic it gets like a fucking like 30 or something it's like universally understood that it's a like completely bad game <coughs> and that's where i'll probably like trash something <coughs> But most of the time, I'll usually... If there's something I don't like, I usually just say, Oh, it's not for me. Because that's what the case is. It's just not for me. I don't know. I don't know. Are you okay? Yeah. Nate? Okay. I don't think they can get through this. Nate. What? Where are we? I'm not sure. <laughs> Go. This explains the U-boat in the Amazon. Nate, come here, look at this. So they found it. They must have broken into the vault and cleared it out. Yeah, but what's the monastery got to do with it? I, I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. Huh. If that's where the statue is now... Oh man, we, we were right on top of it. I bet this will take us to the surface. Guess the Nazis didn't pay their electric bill. Oh, damn it! You know, I bet if we can make it to the generator room, we could get the power turned back on. We just gotta find a way out of here first. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Found a way out. Nice work. Yeah. All right, let's go. Nope. This one's all you, cowboy. What do you mean? Nate, you know I can't make that jump. There is no way I'm leaving you here alone with those we things. We don't have a choice. Just go turn the power on, come back and get me, and then we'll get the hell out of here, okay? Just go. I will be right back. Yeah. Oh, those textures. 18. The bunker. But guess what? 
this one is over. Thank you everybody for watching part 10 of Uncharted Drake's Fortune, and I'll see you all in the next one.